All month long, Eyewitness News is highlighting the four finalists for our Remarkable Women competition. And this morning, I introduce you to Andrea, who helps our four-legged friends in NEPA. You're a good boy. You're a good boy. Veterinarian Dr. Andrea Carr has a passion for helping animals. Since she was a child, she knew taking care of people's pets was her calling. She's now an associate veterinarian at Plains Animal Hospital as she wanted to help animals where she grew up. We see appointments um, much of the day uh, that range from anywhere from wellness appointments, new puppy, new kitten exams, um, all the way to end of life care and you know illnesses that we, we see you know come in through our doors. Her patients trust her to take care of their pets who they consider family members. But these aren't the only animals Andrea assists. Hundreds of rabbits are now being cared for at a Lackawanna County animal shelter after they were rescued from a reported hoarding situation. Earlier this year, Andrea saw reports of 200 rabbits in need of care after being taken in by Griffin Pond Animal Shelter. I had reached out to the shelter director and I said we can help you guys out a little bit and so I had rounded up a couple of our technicians and we neutered 40 rabbits on the weekend. Whenever she sees an opportunity to help, she steps in. Recently, Andrea has been volunteering time at the SPCA of Luzerne County to perform surgeries on animals. I don't like to be bored and I know what my strengths are and if I can utilize them for good. She also takes her skills to other parts of the country. I was on a, a total of three different um, Indian reservations. They were Lakota Sioux out in North and South Dakota. Um, we bounced around a little bit while we were out there. We were providing um, essentially free veterinary care to the residents of these reservations that we were on. Um, and it was extremely eye-opening for me. The residents um, are in desperate need for really any care, care for themselves and care for their pets. And we saw a lot of animals in, in very rough conditions, not because the owners didn't want to get them help, but just because they simply couldn't. Her extensive work with animals is recognized by her colleagues. In 2019, Andrea was chosen to be on the Pennsylvania Veterinary Medical Association Board of Trustees, in which she represents veterinarians in northeastern and central Pennsylvania. She's also involved with the Girl Scouts and serves as director of Camp Makanaqua, which hosts 120 Girl Scouts each summer. And she's a student pilot at the Wyoming Valley Airport, involved with NEPA's chapter of Women in Aviation International, which inspires young girls to explore the world of aviation. I want to live my life with purpose in some way. I am not looking for recognition, honestly. Um, I'm more so, I just want to make sure that everything that I do has purpose and I want to leave some sort of a legacy. A remarkable woman making a remarkable difference in the lives of people and pets. Too cute, that dog, too, right? We'll tune in this afternoon at 3 o'clock on WBRE, and we'll showcase all four of our Remarkable Women finalists. It was really cool meeting with Andrea and just seeing the compassion she had for so many of these animals, which a lot of families in our area consider members of their family. And on top of that, how about that? A pilot, she's also a volunteer with the Girl Scouts. Very impressive. Does so many things for the community. Well,